I'm two hours into the uh, watching it. the new uh, well not that one the new NBA Young Boy documentary that just came out the Trap Lord Oz did this is the sequel to the King Von one so I'm two hours in a lot of dead bodies it's pretty wild yeah <laughs> I ain't seen it yet but yeah it's like six hours I'm tapped in I started like almost as soon as it came out but it's a, it's a, almost kind of a blur because it's just so much information that he's cramming into my head with all these different rappers reach I was cool with Young Boy and shit before all that. Shit. Or whatever, right? And then y'all all, cause I, I just I used to see videos of King Von and Quando and everybody hanging out in the studio all the time. Yeah, they, they um they it was it was it wasn't no it not no beef or no shit like that. You know, I, like like some of his homies would come to Chicago and pull up to my crib and shit. It wasn't really like no it wasn't really like no beef and shit, but you know how that shit go over the time. But pulling up to the crib, like how y'all even build a relationship in the first place? Like y'all met at a studio or something, or how y'all even build in the, like where you meet him at? I actually like met his what, what's the name three three like yeah yeah like that's the who like really pulled up to my crib before and they were like yeah young boy f you, this that type shit. right what what would it be like if you saw him now at this point just awkward yeah <laughs> for sure right have you seen him? all right so recently they said like in the news uh that the fatal bullets came from the police officers. I don't know if you seen any of that. Yeah, I seen that. That was crazy. Like, you talking about from the Vaughn situation? Yeah, from the Vaughn right? situation. That was crazy. Like, yeah, that shit was crazy. Cause that's what I that's some information I didn't know. So it's like, damn, that's oh, so that was true? Uh, they're saying that from the like police report that the fatal bullets is actually like the police could have been the people that killed Vaughn and not Lil Tim or whatever. So like does that change the dynamic of shit knowing like you know what I'm saying? Or still No, uh, no, not really though. Cause shit, I mean it is what it is though, you know. Right. Um, okay, so I probably should have asked this question at the beginning, but what was going on the other day when you were out and about on Instagram Live and you ended up dumping a drink on a homeless nah, guy's head? No, that wasn't even a drink. That was water, and I didn't do that. It wasn't you? Hell no. You were filming somebody else I do just it. was recording it. I was wrong for that, though. You know, that's why I'm doing what I'm doing nowadays. I'm passing out food, money, water, clothes, all type of shit to the homeless, like, twice a month. Right. Like, from now going for it. Were you, were you drunk when you were doing the live? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was. Yeah, I was. Right, and uh, it just just kind of happened. Were you surprised when you got that reaction from people? No, I woke up in the morning, and it was still on my page. I was like, "What the fuck?" I had to hurry up, take it down by that time, but it was already too late. Oh, you Shit. put it on the feed? On the story. It, it was, oh, on the story, right? I was so drunk, I didn't even know I put it on my story. No, I, was... I woke up in the morning, that shit was on my story. I said, "What the fuck?" I had to hurry up, take it down by that time, but it was too late. Everybody was calling me, cussing me out. Saying this, saying that. It's so like even your friends, they were, they were like, "Damn, that's that's a bad move." Yeah. Mm. Hell yeah. So what was it like doing this uh, drive the other day with DJU? It was cool. I, I felt good about it. You know, I felt good like making other people happy and shit. Like I felt good giving back Definitely. to the community and shit like that. That that's was in not, downtown Chicago. Where yeah, that was in right? downtown. It was like actually like three, four places. Yeah. Hell yeah, I did. I felt good as hell doing that. I felt so good to the pro. I said, I'm going to always do it. You don't never uh, think about because, like, there's another viral video. It's like when uh, I'm not sure if y'all, like, it, I think they said y'all stole a car. Or someone stole yeah. a car. And then it, it looked crazy from the video because it was like you was bleeding out type shit. Yeah, Everyone was scared but, when we seen it. It's like, damn. Nah. Yeah, that's because I had got skint in my eye and I got skint in my mouth. And then when I was running out the garage from getting skint, it was like some nigga I don't know, and his girlfriend was right there, like, yeah, he stole like car, he stole like car, and the police came and tackled me, boom. And that's when they came over the phone, over my face, and checking like they was doing something. So you was shot though. I was skint. Yeah, I was skinned never, your I was eye, skint. right? I got skint in the eye and skint in the mouth. Like you yeah. see my mustache, like, like you can tell, like my shit got skint somewhere right there. I don't know which one it is. And it was another dude in like a hoodie. He was he was with you type shit. Like, yeah, yeah, got, yeah, yeah, I got hit in the head. Yeah, I got shot in the head. He was running, he me and both was running out that bit. And so that was really just some, like, wrong place, wrong time type shit? Yeah, for sure. Hell yeah. Damn. Hell yeah, that was. That's crazy. Yeah, because they were trying to say they tracked the car down. No, was... he did track his car down. That's what he did. The nigga tracked his car down. But I didn't know the people who was selling weed was in a stolen car. Oh, all right, type shit. Yeah. I need everybody to check out NoJumber.com. We officially started a blog. It has in-depth articles about current events, music, et cetera, plus all of our content in terms of podcasts, interviews, et cetera. And you can get some exclusive new merch if you check out NoJumber.com. So make sure you tap in.